Hello, and thanks for tuning into my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, hey y'all. Let me say this. I know my voice still sounds a little funny, but OMG, it sounds so much better than it did last week. Anywho, let's get right into this. So today, guys, I just wanted to show you all what's in my Marley tote bag. I added this little pearl um, handle thing off Amazon because I thought it was cute on the bag. I do plan on going somewhere today, so that's why I'm wearing this bag. Um, I haven't really wore this bag since I got it last year. It was a birthday gift from my son, and the handles are white, so I kind of just preserve it not to, you know, get it dirty or anything. So, I had found a coach tag in the parking lot. I don't know why, but it matched my bag, so I was like, you know what? Let me put that tag on there. So, yes, I do have two tags on my bag. I love the detail of this bag. I love these chains. I think they just set the bag off. It has a back pocket. And we're going to start with the next bag. Oop. We're going to start with in the back pocket first. First, I have my little um, stickers for my planner because I do need to get some things done. This was some more stickers I ordered. I don't know if they're in here. They should be. Don't see them because they would be in a plastic bag like this. But anywho. I'm gonna do a sticker collection. Oh wait, it's a classic. Nope, 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 they're not in here. I love Sons of Roses stickers, but you know what? I'm gonna do a whole video for stickers because this ain't about stickers. Okay, that is first. Next I have, and it is a tight fit, y'all. And I'm sorry because it's shaking my camera. Okay, it don't wanna come out. So let's see what can I get out. <laughs> my keys. Guess it just needed two hands. My planner. And this planner is from uh, TF Publishing. And I normally find these at Five Below. I always get lucky at Five Below and find a planner to go inside of the coach notebooks. And they fit perfectly. Just slide it right in there. And they fit perfectly. And I always just stick stuff behind here. This is some stuff I got from Fancy Plans. It was a cash breakdown and some cleaning schedules. Uh, the two ladies I mentioned, Sons and Roses and Fancy Plans, they do have um, their own YouTube channels. So I will link them below in case y'all want to check their stuff out. So of course my phone will be in my purse. My glasses. my cash envelopes and I switch these around a lot so I have my personal money <laughs> gas grub, ones fives which I need to do a cash stuffing because it's the first of the year and I haven't done one in a long time but I said I was gonna stay consistent with my cash stuffing this year because I think I stopped cash stuffing around September of last year and I just haven't really been putting a lot of money away towards my cash envelopes as far as the sinking funds now my gas my spending fast food all that yeah we've been eating okay next is my little wristlet in this particular pocket i have some Tylenol ams and pms and some advil uh my favorite perfume which is gentle fluidy gold by uh mason francis kirkjohn everybody loves baccarat 540 don't get me wrong i have that too it smells good but i love gentle fluidy gold better all right, and I just have a little plenty liner, some lip balm, which this probably ended. Oh, I still got a little bit left. I was going to say, I know I shouldn't, shouldn't have much because I use this when I have my mask on. And when I'm in settings where I don't have my mask, this is my favorite combo. It's just a cute light pink and a little shimmer. These are Chanel lip glosses. That's all I have in there. Yeah, I'm getting congested again. Whenever I talk a lot, I can just feel the flame coming up out of my throat. All right, and this is what we have in there. On the side pocket, I have my taser. Some Kleenex. Yeah, I'm just going to start stuffing this stuff back in. I'm not going to take everything out. Two tool pins. Well, one tool pin and one marker. A portable. Wait a minute, y'all. It ain't going uh, I have to go take my COVID test on Monday, so I have my medical cards, a hand warmer slash phone charger, 
so that's in that pocket. In the big pocket, I just have some tags and the receipt looks like. Nope, this is a receipt to something else that I bought. So just some tags. Oh wait, this is a receipt to this purse, <laughs> I thought so. And some hand sanitizer. And y'all, like I said, I don't use this purse often. So look, <laughs> still got stuff on there. Um, Now this, there is nothing in this. I just left it in here because I do like leaving my small leather goods in bags that they go with. So I don't have to look for them. And as you can see, I haven't took the tag off. And I bought this last year. Ooh. Maybe that's on my purse. Oh, let me take this stuff out of there. I didn't realize the... um. Stuff it was still in. I just thought it was holding the shape. I should have known though. I should have known. Okay, so that is that. Have some lotion, which stick right on in there. I got this from the Dollar Tree a couple days ago, and I just been sticking it in all my purses. Because once I can't use that Chanel anymore, I'm gonna open that. I got a little um granola bar. Some organic fruit snacks. Yeah, I'm trying to lose weight. I'm trying to lose 20 pounds in the next like three months. I'm hoping. We're gonna see. If y'all trying to lose weight, let me know. Maybe we can do some check-ins together or something, okay? All right, next is a little boot left Goyard pouch and I mean throw it like that, but in it I just have um I keep my receipt my receipts, my coupon. Oh, it is a receipt. I need to scan this with my fetch reward. Y'all, if y'all not using Fetch, Ibotta, and um, Receipt Hall, and what else it is? Um, it's one more. Check out 51. I don't know what y'all doing with y'all stuff, especially if you got kids and you're going grocery shopping. Like, those are apps you definitely need to be using so you can get some cash. Y'all, I'm sorry. I'm trying to see if I can steal cash this in. I sure can because it's on the first, so I'm definitely going to be scanning that in. All right, and this item, no, it is not authentic because I just want to let y'all know it's a whole lot of I don't know why but what's real what's fake stuff going on and I be stressing what's real on my channel and if it's fake I tell y'all but yet people still be is that real where you get that from I got it from Louis Vuitton I got it from coach I got it from here I got it from there this was one of them Amazon things back in the day um if you been on YouTube for longer than three or four years and you've been watching people then you know Amazon used to sell Louis Vuitton uh, well, replica Louis Vuitton, replica Goyard bags, replica everything. And back then, I got a bag in, um, from Goyard, and I got some little dupes. Um, they don't even say Louis Vuitton. Some little dupes from Amazon that are in the Damier event print. So, that is that. So, I'm just clarifying. So, y'all know. I have a coin purse, and yes, I do have coins in it. And then I have my wallet. Sometimes I do keep my wallet back here so it's easy accessible. And then when I know like I'm gonna do certain things, I do put it inside of my purse because it will fall out. And of course, this wallet holds a ton of cards. You got six right here, a cash slot, another cash slot, another cash slash phone slot, some more cash slots and six more cards and another cash slot. I love big wallets. Big wallets work for me, not only because I keep cash envelopes, but because I keep a lot of cards. Excuse me, and a lot of cash for the most part. Well, I used to, which is why I like big wallets. All right, guys. So that is it. That is all of what's in my bag. And yes, this bag does hold a lot of stuff. Does it hold as much as a never full? No. But it does hold a lot for its size. So I have no complaints when it comes to that. I'm gonna stick my stickers back in the back. And I think I'm, I got this case from the original coach store, the boutique, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and order me one from the outlet, even though I didn't see any more 10X Max. And y'all, it's just certain things I am I'm into. For a long time, I was in iPhones. I had to have every new iPhone. I had the four, the five, the six, then after the six, I was like, you know what? Every year you're buying a new phone, flat out. Like, you're spending too much money on cell phones. <laughs> they all do the same thing. But then after the six, they came out with the water resistant. And I'm like, you know what? Just wait, because next year is going to be even better. It might be able to be submerged underwater this time. So 
So I did get the 10. But now that I'm into YouTube, I think I'm gonna have to go ahead and get the 13 so that I can have more clear videos. Plus I want it to have as much space as it can. Back then when you had a 10, I think I had like 500 and some odd gigabytes. But anywho, this ain't about phones, it's about bags. But I was just saying, it's about time for me to get a new phone. <laughs> because I have used this case and this case to no end. Like I've had them since 10s came out. These are my main two go-to cases. However, I just wish Louis Vuitton would add a little, you know, pull out. I put this in there myself. Oh, there go my ID. I'm glad I picked this up. I didn't even realize I didn't have my ID in my wallet, y'all. What was I thinking? Oh, yeah. So, definitely finna add it now, though. And, guys, this wallet also came with a tassel. However, I bought it as is because this was the last one they had, and I had to have a wallet to match this bag. My son did buy the bag. All of the small of the goods I bought because I just had to have accessories to go with my bag. I'm just, I don't know. I just need things to go to my bag. So it doesn't have the little um, wristlet strap, which I might just order some off Amazon. Or, I mean, if need be, I can try something like this if I can get this off. So if I want, I, I mean, I could do something like that. Would I carry this like this? No, I will not. That's just too much for me. If this was a smaller bead, then I definitely would carry it like this, but the beads are too big for me. But I'm just saying, you can put anything on this and utilize it. So as a wristlet. It is hard for me to get these things off once I get them on here. And it was a struggle getting it off that bag. But... I kind of like them on there, so I'm definitely going to put them back because they went on easy. It just took a minute to get off. Don't know why. But anywho, guys, that is it. That is all for what's in my bag. And as you saw, is it right on up? all right thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did and you haven't already go ahead and give me a thumbs up and go ahead and make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see more content i post bye y'all